All right. So those of you guys with shakers know the problem here where you don't have the half cover on this side of the engine. So Steve here has had the half cover painted, white knuckle, the P5 blue accents, and we're gonna go ahead and install this one here, which is pre-cut from Scalia Motorsports. And this is cut out to go around the air hose or the, the output here of the shaker. And uh, we're gonna see if it fits and how it looks. All right, so get the piece in. We definitely got to take off the shaker base and the shaker and then uh, do a little cut to the frame. So you have to cut a piece out over here. Uh, I'm guessing it looks similar to this, nice and thick, or is it the same, about that thick? Yep. All right. There. All right. And then what's the deal? You just move the hose, pop it in, and you're done? Flip the hose up, out of the way. Here, I'll hold the hose. How come that hose is brown? What's going on with that? Because uh, all the factory rubber hoses from Chrysler are brown, no matter how much you treat them. <laughs> all right, get so, that piece in there. Drop this underneath here, set it on top of the two rubber things. Done. Look at that. All right, here you go. I'm going to let you do that. Okay. Well, we got to put the trim on. All right. Uh, I don't okay. have a pop off to it when I pop this off. The trim is going to take a second. Well, let's see how it fits without the trim. Okay. That fits right in there. Yep, goes back right in its factory location, like that. And it's got a nice room around it too. Mm -hmm. Cool. Around. Cause like that's just, I'm curious how that's gonna hold up. That looks flex really active. It's pretty good. I bend it back and forth a lot. I've never seen B5 cover like that before. Yeah. It stays on though, cause it has teeth. Yeah, I think the B5 car, the, 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 I think it looks really good with that border on it. And it's also really soft. Yeah. So, I wonder if there's a way you could paint it, I guess, flexed out maybe? I think you can buy this stuff in cloth colors. Yeah, I'm going to say that, I'm gonna say that it should be black. Yeah. Just a quick note on that B5 blue trim you see there. That was uh, painted B5 blue by Scalia Motorsports. They used a flex agent in there as more of like an experiment to see if we can pull this off. But as you start really stretching it around some of those tight corners, it's starting to show signs of cracking. So we don't think it's gonna hold up. So I don't think this is actually gonna be a final product. It's more of like a fun experiment to toy with. She yells at me, I don't know what she yells at me for. Yeah, but don't forget to too, the group. all this is gonna be covered. This yeah. is gonna be covered. You're gonna see like the cool outline, let's see. Yeah, I was hoping there was enough left of this piece you got to put on my hair. Where? Get enough to put it around here? Hold on a second. Put what? around here. I'm gonna put it on my winky. Well, I think you should match. I was hoping this was gonna be extra enough. Extra. <laughs> right, geez, it's a bit too Get some extra. Yeah. Yeah. It's too I'll put black yeah. on that. <laughs> I have to trim it down. You don't even see that though. Once you put the shaker cover on, you don't even see that. And I see everything, really Mike. Well. Yeah, I know, I know. I'm just trying to, you know, soothe your OCD. I need people to soothe mine from time to time. <laughs> All right, as you can see here, the install was pretty quick and easy. We did it at a car show in the morning. The hardest part would be cutting that little section of the uh, shaker brace. Make sure you kind of wrap that area in towels to prevent metal from going throughout your engine bay. You can grab everything you saw in this video at scalia-motorsports.com. He's got the half covers pre-cut, priced nicely, as well as a couple bucks extra for painting. I believe it's somewhere around 80 bucks at the time of making this video. If you're DIY like myself, he sells a template kit where you can just toss it on there and cut it out on your own. Once again, you can grab everything from scalia-motorsports.com. I'll have links to everything in the description below. All right, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please gently press that like button. I'm gonna close it out with some footage from the car show. If you are stopping by for the first time, consider subscribing. And as always, thanks for watching. Too much 
I'm swallowed Now I'm the fool Why you're breaking rules Dangerous path that I follow Oh Go on, just do what you do Yeah. 